Welcome to the short video presentation by Dog Rook. Today I will show you how to use this humane collar to train your dog not to bark. Let's unpack this shockless vibrating collar. The Dog Rook collar is equipped with high quality material and a modern design which is soft and comfortable for your dog to wear. The reflective stripes will provide safety for your dog at any hour of day and night. The collar comes with an additional cover of another color that is interchangeable at your will. Two high capacity 6 volt batteries will allow the device to work several times longer than competitors' collars. Two pairs of plastic hypoallergenic prongs are available at different lengths for both short and long-haired dogs. We take care only to use materials that are safe for your dog. This device comes with a user's manual and a link to register for an extended warranty with the manufacturer. Let's move on to the collar setup. Now I'll show you how to properly change batteries in the dog root collar. First, remove the decorative front panel by gently pulling on it. Then, loosen the strap and open the battery compartment. Carefully insert the batteries. The device will beep when it is ready to use. Close the lid, tighten the strap, and readjust the main panel. If you know you will not be using the device for a long period of time, we recommend that you take the batteries out of the collar so they do not lose their charge. Now you are ready to adjust the collar for your dog. Now I'll show you how to modify the length of the dog rook so your dog won't want to fuss with it. First measure the correct strap length for your dog. The strap should be adjusted so that one finger can fit comfortably between it and your dog's neck. When you've determined the desired collar length, cut the excess with scissors. Now that you've cut the right length, stop the threads from unraveling by cautiously holding a small flame to the frayed edge of the strap. This will bind the threads into one place. Put away the collar in a safe place to cool. To prevent the collar from tightening or loosening around your dog's neck, clamp it into place. Follow these steps. Remove the strap from the lock to adjust the length. Find the required length and adjust the end with a special lock. Check that the strap does not shift significantly while it's on your dog. Done! Time for the next step. Before placing the collar on your dog, it is important to set the device to proper sensitivity levels. This is done with the help of two adjustment buttons. Levels are controlled by these plus and minus buttons. To adjust the sensitivity, first press the button marked with a minus sign. The collar will emit the tone. Press the minus button again until it stops. Now you are at level 1. We recommend using the 4th sensitivity level for most dogs. To move to the 4th sensitivity level, just click the plus button. A beep will accompany each increased sensitivity level. To test the device, blow into the small hole located on its back. Let's start. The first signal, moving on. The second signal. The third sound signal comes with a vibration. Levels 4, 5, 6 and 7 also activate a different vibration sequence. The final, 7th signal initiates a 1 minute hibernation mode. The vibration sequences and hibernation period are warnings for you to ensure the safety of your dog. If the collar does not respond to your dog's barks, check that the device is set correctly before increasing sensitivity level. If you see that the dog stops barking, reduce the sensitivity level and begin to wean your furry friend off of the collar. When you find that your dog's behavior has permanently changed for the better, it is no longer necessary to use the device. All done! You are now well equipped to train your dog with the Dogbrook Humane Collar. Good luck!